Dante had guarded Brenda, he would have told me. The jackal has evidence. This family found a duty roster on the computer from three years ago when Dante was still in uniform. He was assigned to Brenda. Show me what you found. We got incoming. The roster. Names on a schedule. He, he could have been reassigned. Okay, well, there is proof that the betrayer met and guarded. You know what, Spinelli? I asked you not to call him that. His name is Dante. Fine. Well, behold, evidence of Dante's lie of omission. I, I don't, I don't get it. There could be a hundred explanations, you know. I mean, if Brenda never came to town, Dante would have no reason. Yeah, but Brenda did come to town, and he said he had never met her. I've been above board. With Fine, but we got four dead guys with European passports, and we're no closer to knowing where the boss is. What went wrong? Or do you not want to talk about it? No, uh, it was Brenda. She, uh, it wasn't her fault. We put her in a crazy situation. She was bound to, to freak out. Jimmy, what the hell was your day? Um... Spinelli showed me something interesting. Yeah. It's a picture of you with Brenda. You were in a police officer's uniform in New York a few years back. It was uh, three. It was uh, three years ago. Why didn't you tell me? Were you so? I should have mentioned something about her when she got to Port Charles, but she didn't even remember who I was. How would she not remember you? You were her bodyguard. Well, she, she sees a bunch of guys in a uniform. She doesn't see the person underneath the uniform. Like, this is before I knew, I knew that I was Sonny's son, before, before I, I knew that, that, that Brenda was the love of Sonny's life. I, I, I let it slide, but I should have told you. you yes. No, you don't need to tell me about every single woman that you guarded. This one caught me by surprise. Look, look at me. There's nothing to hide between me and Brenda, okay? It's okay, it's fine. I get it. I, I love you, and only you. So you knew this, Alexander? <laughs> 